today I'm with a local barber. He has been doing this for the past 25 years and he said this was transferred to him from his father, no, from his grandfather to his father, it was transferred to him and he has transferred it to his own son. So this is four generations doing this right here. See, we have talent in Africa. We have talent. So this is a, I'm not calling him a young man. Can I do a grand picking? Okay, he doesn't have a grandchild yet. But wait, you are not seeing my face for this first time. My name is Pate Yaba. I'm a YouTuber based in Abuja, Nigeria. And as I promised you guys, I'll be giving you guys great content. See, I was just passing. And I saw this content and I said, it's not going to waste. Your girl will bring you content. So, according to him, what he said is, this bag, if he did not give me permission to put my hand in this bag, and I put my hand, he's going to cut me. So, I don't even want to try it. I don't even to try it. So, if I put my hand here, something will cut me. So, I don't want to pull my hand. But this is his workshop. This is his Babin Salon. What name will I call it again, Francis? This is his kiosk. This is his supermarket. This is his bank. This is his POS. And he's using this to feed his family. He actually told me in confidence that he has three wives. And he has been feeding them with this thing. So if this is the video you want to watch, please stick around. Stick around. Is your baby your baby? Eh? <laughs> Six saw, I'm six saw on this saw, unpredictable moves. I'm on a zig. So I met this local Baba. He has been doing this for the past 25 years. And according to him, this was a trade that was given to him by his father. His father got it from his grandfather. His grandfather got it from his great grandfather. So this is the fourth generation. It's a generational thing. He doesn't know if the past people have done it. And this is a local Baba, a local razor blade. He does it with just his hand, with detergent, and no omu, nothing. But according to the people that are doing it, they like this one because it's cheaper, uh, it's smoother, it's straight to the point. They don't need to struggle. He comes, as in, he goes door by door. So you don't need to go to the salon to do it. He comes to meet you where you are. And there's also something behind this is barbing. He has a little bag that he used as his workshop. And that bag has a mysterious thing attached to it. If you touch it without him giving you permission, you will have a cut. Your hand will bleed. Yes, it will bleed because it is an inheritance. This bag has been in existence for the past five generations, almost 100 years, according to him. So let's get into the interview and meet my local barber. At this point, he was curious. I want to know why I was filming him after I have explained. And he was like, is it that the whole world will see him? He doesn't want the whole world to see him. And I was like, the whole world needs to see you because if they don't see you, they don't know your story, they will not believe that you've been doing this thing for 25 years and it was handed over to you from your father, from your grandfather to your father, to you and to your son. And that is when he agreed to it. Okay, okay. Okay, Okay, use his battery. Okay, I'm chicken one 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 Okay, at this point, I was asking him to explain the local clipper he uses, the one he was using when I met him, and I was fascinated. And he said the name is Aska, and he put half of a razor to it to use it. That's what he's actually looking for from his bag to explain to us how he uses it.
I know they can ask a resorting. I'm on the resorting. I okay, half raise on a can as a ring. Coinca Yanzuko Kagama de Sani, like a Yuma resorting, Woni Mutunkuma. Okay, now I call ya one Yagama Iki. Okay, but like I use in Shikuma. So it come up. Okay, now you might want the ice key. Okay, Sani Yanzuko, one day I now and a carba. Minute, there are they. Under the other, I eat the number. Okay, head and be a is two hundred. K. Inca Baka Yining. Part of his law is he doesn't bab women hair. If you want to bab, shave your high bra, he does not touch woman's hair. So I was very curious to know more. Okay, Babanka, look at Saluni. Look, I say, look at Saluni. I got Okay, this is what his grandfather did. Now handed over to his father. So him now is doing. So Yaron Kamaya, are you wanting? Eh, how many Yaro make an addition? Canada Yaro Matanawa. So one now Buyana Baka, Kudi, Kanaima, Kanabasu, Kanabasu, Abuchi, I could, I wonder. Eh? So Yazuko in I was asking him if I want to learn the trade, how long will I take? He said, at most three months. If I'm very sharp, I can do this for three months. Okay, three months. It will take me three months to learn this thing. So one abu ke ingena de one abu yanzu na zema professional. So and come, cause show us the thing na. Mene ne peg ya na ye achiki. One kaya ne kiziki. Eh. Kaya na dewa. One ba kambu chesanyo. Okay, you na say you ma one iko. Muzi mugeni munti manze yimi shimana. Muti ndi yana na. One. Why you pana? Seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But I'll be okay, I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better. Eh, Mugeni, now they want none. Hundred naira. So this way you do now. Casa mu hundred naira. Okay. Okay, but that's a koyaba. In your side, Hanu meze paru. Hanu kiza yenge jini. Kana o kana kana kana. Kaa rike kiza. Kaa rike mi chwana mi chibido kiza. Ah, do mi raise or ding ne? Go the clipper. One of my dad over in Kuba raised ice cream for them. I won't go there. Mrene abu mrene yaka wa abu sora chiki. Menene Abu Sora Chiki. Wana. Can I carry ya? Carry ya. Eba. Take a little like this in Nigeria. Go on here and I dare ya wai. Yo. 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 And I'm saying it's a lie, and he's saying I should try it, but I'm not sure I need it. Okay, because I said I'm not Okay, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. Wait, hey. Yes, you're not going to tell me. Yes, you're not going to tell me. Yes, you're not going to tell me. Okay. Yeah. You're not going to tell me. Okay. You're not going to tell me. Okay. So, you're not going to tell me. You're not going to tell me. Jenny. Engineer, you are doing this to pay. I, I, okay. 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 From one generation to another. Okay. I'm not not Magana. I'm saying Jekang. Mainly the Lilin Jekang. Mainly the Jekang. Jekang. 
Okay, not that the bag have jazz. No, it's because it was transferred from it was one person. There must be this particular person in the family that, that must inherit that bag. Okay, this bag now was transferred to this man. Yes, from his father. It's not him that actually owns the, bag. owns the bag. Wow. From his father. No, he said from his grandfather to his father to him. So definitely he must transfer it to one of his child. What a business. And, and his child must transfer it to another of his child. And they are saying that he's not doing this bagging because he's looking for, he's money. Looking for money to feed. Yes. It's just that it's an inheritance, inheritance son. You have to, something. my he brother. must do it. This life is deep. You must do it. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not like our normal baby salon that will go to the baby salon and bab your head. Them is not about the money. Business that do it. Okay.